Yeah, Alex doesn't have a mirror at all. Oh boy. B -b 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 Bowels time. Oh wait, let me put the trap back up. Brick, find help, find some bricks. You know you're gonna need the brick. Right, I found rifle ammo now. Oh my lights work again. Wait, what was that? Yep. Brick. Good. Okay, now I'm ready to fight. Where's she gonna show? She's, uh, right over here. So, uh, how are we gonna bring her out? Is she just gonna try to grab us? Oh! Hi, she Wesker! Can't jump down. Easy in raid mode, you can. What? You can't jump down? It's in raid mode, you can. She won't stop turning around. Okay. Wait, I think her AI broke. Okay, no. There we go. She's good. Oh, I'm thrilled. Oh, I don't have any grenades. Wait, Mike, can you check the inventory? Do I have any grenades? That can be made? No? No bottles? Alright. No bottles. <laughs> We're on our own here. Oh, found ammo. What? Okay, I'll keep that in mind. Yeah, Alex is, is going to be talking a lot of junk during this fight. Hmm. Oh, brick time. Oh, she's back kicking me. Where was that magnum ammo? Oh, I, I, I picked it up and gave it to you already. Oh, awesome. Oh, Phil, I think I'm down. She, she back kicked me like three times. She's not gonna let me just get to you. Yeah. That cheating grandma. Okay, got you. Yeah, that w that wasn't cool, man. She just kick kick. She no what no what is she what was it called? Oh, she horse kicked me. There we go.
the heck is she going? Don't know. Oh, poison. Oh, up here? Yeah, no, she spits poison. Oh, I threw my brick down there. Well, it's not covered with poison, but... Oh, it's just that Ooh. one... It's just that one spot. Take that. Huh. Oh, uh, grazie. Grazie. Yeah, I gotta work together here. Even if I can't... Even if my attack power is weak, I can still do something. Come on, feckless pissant, I'm down here. Assault rifle family. Oh, well, I just realized the, the bricks respawn. Oh, good. So I have a, a, a limitless su supply of bricks. So I think I might just spam through them. If that's the case, being that that's the case. Infinite bricks, I... That's like a godsend. Will she spit poison from there? Oh no! Okay, you better come down here. Uh, I'm making my way there right now. Rita? I got, I got a couple of brick brick hits. Yeah, brick hits in there. Oh, there's still poison up here. Are you kidding me? Yeah, there is. Oh wait, but I, I have another brick. Oh, I think my favorite line's coming up. <laughs> kidding me, man? Okay, well, I'll... Oh my god, Mike, no. Thanks, Barry. <laughs> Just shut up. Thank you, Barry. That's why I love you. Yeah. Okay, where is she? Put it in her place. Where is she? <coughs> I mean, put it in its place. Did I knock her down, or did you knock her down? No, that was you. Is that Magnum ammo? Yeah, don't send it to me yet. Come on, I need my brick again. She looks like Mama Peach. What? That's what Nabbit player just said. <laughs> My God. At the very least, Peach has a pretty face. Yeah. This lady, this lady is just lit. Actually, so, some of her concept artwork reminds me of this one. Uh, this one uh, fan made character for a fan made uh, fifth case for Apollo Justice. Uh, some concept artwork, artwork reminds me of that anyway. Concept. I think I knocked her down. Can't really see. Oh, I just pointed out something. Wait! Got her? Mmm! Brick power! <coughs> Okay. Alright, important cutscene coming up. Dr. Farley says she looks like Quasimodo. Huh? Who's that?
Moira! You did all this for me? Yeah. Sorry, it took half a year. Fucking technology. <laughs> Fuck it right up the ass. <laughs> see this. Yep, it saved. Sure that's saving? No, that's the objective, Mike. The saving appears on the bottom left corner. Alright, we'll we'll do this fight and then we'll re rewatch the cutscene that we missed. Cause uh <laughs> that was that was bull right there. Uh, Mike? Yeah? Mike, I think I might need you. Uh one second. Yeah, no, uh, it didn't, no, it didn't save, like I figured. Yeah, yeah like I need more healing. I'm waiting for you to run by so I can shoot that uh, canister. Man, if anything, I'll freaking shoot it. Oh, got a direct shot on her weak spot. Alright, see ya, Anthony. Alright, bro, peace. I can't heal you. I mean, obviously. I have this!
gotta be kidding me, these stupid things. I'm just going around the same circle, who cares? I know there are other ways that you can go, but I figure that this is probably easier. Yes, got her weak spot. Now the best part is that oh, I, I'm, I'm controlling one of the main characters as a second player. Yeah, that's pretty awesome. We got the good ending, Dr. Fartman, which is exactly why we're doing this <laughs> right now. Ooh, I think I got one shot off of her. You're going through the this pathway over here? Mm -hmm. Trying to. Keyword. Keyword. <laughs> Yo! Did the rocket zoom right past my head? Oh, I'm, about to, I'm about to see that right here. Watch my screen. <coughs> so basically, nice shot, Mike. Uh, yeah, nice shot. Look, Moira, I know I should have let you have your space. It's okay. I gave you plenty of reasons to worry. You held your own out there, Moira. Of course she did. She's a fucking Burton. <laughs> anyway, let's let these guys come in and clean up. So, what are you gonna do now, Barry? I'm gonna go back to being a father. Credits! Woo! Well, we beat it on survival, though. It, it sucks that OBS crashed right in the middle of a... A, a really awesome cutscene. A very awesome cutscene. So we're but gonna, we will go back and re-watch it, just, you know, because... Uh, though, whenever, whenever I put, the, put it up on YouTube, I'll, I'll probably just... Uh, edit it? Yeah, fix yeah. it. I'll, I'll fix that up. Yeah, we will show that... Cut, cut uh, that cutscene that we missed. So. Yeah, uh, we're not missed, but we'll we'll, we'll look at it right again. Again, so I'll put it on. I'll throw it on YouTube. Throw it in the editor and just. Yeah, yeah. Whew, wow, that was a lot of fun. <sighs> so, uh, what are your thoughts about this game, Mike? Uh, Claire has a terrible voice. Therefore, the entire game sucks. <gasps> <laughs> no, no, no. That's not what I think. <clears throat> No, um... Like, why do people clear her voice? Her voice is fine. I don't know. I, I like Alice... I, I mean, like, if she spoke... Yeah, like, if she spoke like that, then, uh, okay. I, mean, I, I like Alice in Core 2, <clears throat> but I don't think she's absolute perfection. I, I think she's awesome, and I think that who, the person that voice uh, uh, Clara here is also, also did a great job. Which we will see the English voice actors, so we can see who uh, voice too. 
Yeah. <clears throat> and then the people are like really vo- a lot a bunch of people are vocal about them. Like her voice is terrible. She sounds fine to me. Like every um, in almost every game, the characters get a different voice actor. I think Claire's had three different voice actors so far. I mean, the only character. I mean, well, yes. Yeah, so is like what uh, Chris has had. I forget. The, well, obviously, he has Roger Craig Smith now. I forget who his voice actor before was, though. Wait, did Chris only have... He had three voice actors, right? Because he was voiced by... He was voiced by someone else in the original RE, right? Yeah, and then the remake... I think... I'm not sure if Code Veronica was different. I think Code Veronica was the same as... Oh, actually, I'm not sure. Uh, Leon has had three different voice actors. I forget his RE2 voice. He, then he had... Uh, sh- shame on me. Uh, then he had Paul Mercer... And now he has Matthew Mercer. No, they're not related. Just the same last name. Similar last name. Um, Barry has had three as well. Or oh, actually, no, he might have had four. And that picture right there with uh, Moira is from uh, the extra episode, The Struggle. Struggle. And it is quite the struggle. Yep, man, I cleared that on survival. Because uh, the only difficulties were casual and survival. I'm like, well, I'm not playing on easy. Well, no, uh, actually, you weren't sure, so I just said go for survival, and you went for it, and you you ended up beating it. Yeah. Uh, though you lose a ration for a retrying. Yeah, so you actually have lives. Yeah, the struggle works like an arcade game. You get you, you the you have to get lives, extra lives yourself. Some some people don't like the setup, but I thought it was kind of interesting how it was how it functioned. I mean, it's, it's like a miniature arcade game. Just survive. Get what yeah, you I can. think. I, I think some people gotta just be a bit more loose, you know. Open. Yeah. Gotta be open, man. Can't let everything get to you. Gotta be like, okay, what's different? What's what can I do here? Can I succeed? Yoshi Star, can you succeed? Yes, you can. Japanese voice recording. Japanese voice actors. Claire Redfield. Uh, Yoko. Yoko Kaido. Kaido. Barry Burton, Yushika Yara, Yusaku Yara. Hmm. We're very bad at pronouncing Japanese names. Yeah, we are. Koji Okano. No, um, Koji Okano. That's actually that's pretty similar to my un- one of my uncle's names. Uncle's name. <clears throat> uh, okay, Claire Redfield, James. Baker? James, okay, there. Jeffrey, uh, DC Douglas, Matt Mercer, yep, DC Douglas, voice yeah. of... Well, James Baker, whoever you are, you did an awesome job as Claire. I, I don't care, uh, I, uh, I know other people were vocal about it, but I think your, your performance was, was absolutely great here. So, no negatives for me. Oh, Vic missed all that. Oh, oh, uh, yeah. Sorry, I'm still sorry to hear about that, bro. Wait, but are you gonna be able to go to Chicago? Oh, we should probably turn off the fan. Yeah, we probably should. Uh, I think it's. I, th- I think we got enough air. I kind of forgot the fan was on. Oh yeah, uh... Wait, so yeah, what were your thoughts about the game? Because then we just made a joke about the about people making fun of the voice actor. Uh, voice actress. I thought this game was great. I know uh, Phil's favorite game of our game is still 4. Though I think this this one is definitely one of my favorites now. Yeah, um... I, w- I would actually say that this is one of my favorites as well. Uh, I really enjoyed it, you know. Claire and Barry coming back was just awesome because we like okay well we, we we've seen less of Barry than so Claire so seeing Barry come back was to me even more awesome but having Claire come back as well because the last time we saw her was in Resident Evil Degeneration which was a movie yeah, I think this that Rev 2 is also a good, good example of uh, like no like no matter how like between RE6 and Rev 2 because RE6 had a huge budget, whereas this game didn't have that big of a budget. Yeah, I feel this game... 
Especially the story mode was better. Yeah, did what it was supposed to do correctly. Yeah. Hey, don't get me wrong, I still do like RE6. Me too. For the multiplayer, really. Like, you know, like mercenaries mode. And, and some fun co-op mishaps. Yeah, some, yeah, yeah, and the, the co-op in the story mode is fun. Oh, Resident Evil Degeneration. Why, why is the movie there? It's part of, it's part of the plot, the yeah. storyline. Now, the, 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 watch that movie. The, the CG movies are, are canon to the games. Yep, they are. But yeah, uh, I really enjoyed this game. I really enjoyed it. Good game. My favorite, like Mike said, is still RE4. But, you know. Oh, and, oh, wait, I think there's another cutscene also, coming. story time. Yeah, there's another cutscene coming up. Story time. <laughs> so, he's in China now? However, at this time, we're unable to find him. All right. Tell Piers to look after him. As well as the tragedy that befell the city of Tall Oaks earlier this week. Authorities are struggling to stem the panic that has taken hold of China. The UN anti terrorism. Dad, would you get your ass in gear? Claire will be here any minute. Late last night, one of the VSA. Oh, excuse me. Hey, Polly, you see my jacket over there? Natalia, are you upstairs? Come on down and get ready! A cage went in search of a bird. But now, the bird is gone. The bird has changed. Well, that's one way to change the mood of an ending. That's a ball kicker. Yeah, the bad ending make it makes it actually makes this worse. Uh, yeah, much worse. So yeah, remember the experiment was for Alex to transfer <clears throat> to transfer her mind to another body, which would take six months. The bad ending, that process uh, uh, was on time. No, the process uh, gets there even quicker because uh, Natalia was about to die, so Alex uh, took over. Here, though, uh, well, yeah, uh, done. That, that, well, at least Barry and Mora are okay. The time has come. Aw. Uh, oh. Uh, meat grinder. Well, let's I had enough of the Minari 6. That's right, Brick, you should say Brick Slayer. Sharpshooter. Fish in a barrel. Oh, yeah, my accuracy was okay. Hey, no deaths. That's cool. Rev three, bring it. Here, here. But yeah, RE six had a huge budget. This game didn't. This game turned was turned out better due to well, being 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 more of more of what made Resident Evil unique. Resident Evil. Go to episode select. Uh, there it is. Wait a minute. Is there enough room for another difficulty? I yeah, hope. there is. I hope not. Um, no one else found another difficulty. Hmm. That that's the that's the highest one. So I guess this is the professional mode. Most most likely. I can only imagine the hell. Oh, well, at least we did. Oh no, no, we didn't get to be. Oh, we. Our total time is five hours. Ugh. It is. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what's, what, what, what's your total time for normal? So, oh, got it down by two hours. You're That's you're you're getting there. Mm, wait, no, I wanted to check the. Uh... Oh yeah, we're gonna check that cutscene real soon. I just wanna. Let's see, what is this? I can't even buy it. You don't have enough. It's fifty thousand. Oh my, my god, god, it must be a pretty badass weapon. <laughs> right, check Wait, no, weren't the cutscenes there? 
Yeah, check the cutscenes real quick. We'll uh, mute, mute, the, mute the microphone so that we can record it right here. Okay, it was hope. Okay, uh, we're gonna play that cutscene that... That we missed because OBS crashed. Ready? Let's go. That was awesome, and... I, some people actually have a problem with part of that cutscene because of Moira's vulgar mouth, as some people put it, but listen to how she talks, listen to how relieved Barry sounds. That was a genuinely emotional moment right there. You, you can see she's in tears as she's saying it. They are just so happy to see each other and to... Like, like, she, like she saw Barry really went out of her way to, to really make up for what he's done to her. The same way Barry tried to do it to make up for what he did to his, uh, his buddies at his former Team Stars. AKA Jill and Chris. Jill and Chris. So, yeah, and some people got some people got mad just because Moira cursed right there. That you can you li, 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 just listen to how her voice wasn't there. That was genuine happiness right there. So wait, since when did vulgar language make a scene less emotional? I don't know. Some so, since so, when? So, like some people, some people analyze well, but so, sometimes they don't they don't really analyze analyze, analyze at all. Yeah, if I'm pronouncing my words incorrectly. No, that that was a genuinely really really good cuts in there. I, I um I really like that. Also, um, Vic. I mean, like, what were they expecting? No cursing at all. This game is rated M. I don't know. Oh, well, uh, they didn't curse my names before. <laughs> oh, you know. I mean, actually, they they what. The first time they used the F bomb was RE5. Yeah, Kirk, Kirk, yeah, Kirk. And then in RE6, actually, even in RE1, the remake, the, the, I think there are some swearing there as well, especially. They're in, swearing in all of them. Yeah, actually, yeah, thank you. They're swearing in all of them, not not vulgar like J Jake or like completely vulgar like Jake, and not mildly vulgar like Moira, but still like this the like as you go on with the story it actually it actually justifies why she's so bitter towards him yeah like there's there's development between the both of them here like legit like real yeah we, you know we saw more get her character development arc entirety because it's the first time we're seeing her and we saw Barry get more character development and being that she's becoming like like she's literally becoming Barry 2.0 and I actually am completely okay with that mm-hmm Oh, I love what she said to Clara when uh, Ding went out, got on the job. Yeah, <laughs> that's epic, awesome. So shut up. Yeah, I agree with you. She started. I don't think there was anything wrong with that cutscene. It's a mesh on their personality. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Yeah, a mesh on their. Uh, sorry, let me read what without that whistling sound. Let me read what Yoshi Star what Yoshi Star just said. It's a mesh of. On their personality and what moment they're currently in, there is nothing wrong with that scene. And from my perspective, I completely agree with that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, J Jake had him out too, but uh, when it but he he had a stalker, so he <laughs> yeah he <laughs> had a stalker. Like an ex. How did how did Leon say it? No, but when Leon and Jake were talking about it, he was like uh, more like an ex girlfriend. Oh, oh yeah, yeah that's, that's what Jake said about Usa. He's like, nah, more like an ex-girlfriend. Then Leon's like, you'll you'll get used to it. And then Jake looks at him like, what? <laughs> yeah, and that's a that's a nice a, nod to Ari too, because yeah. Leon was in a similar situation where he was being stalked throughout the entire game. His first day of the force. Not only was he in the incident in Raccoon City, he was being followed by Mister X. <laughs> so the can the the canon storyline for that would be Claire, Claire A and Leon B, because uh, Claire A is where Sherry gets infected, which carries over to Ari six. Yeah, which uh, she has. So is there anything else we want to do here? Should we just mess around rain mode? Huh. Um. Uh, Vic, Vic's giving some unique, <laughs> unique oh, word. Oh God! Damn it, Vic! Unique word choice of words. Anyway, <laughs> thanks, Vic. What should we do? Mm -hmm. Well, there's still time. We can uh, call it a stream and just uh, rec record some more Bayonetta two off screen. 
Because as yeah, of, we could do that. As of as of here, uh, well, this is this part is going to go up so much later. But I'm recording. We're we're, we're about to record chapter twelve. <sighs> we're dead. Yeah. Oh, well, I'm dead. I'm the one playing. I'll just I'll just be sure. Well, then if we're going to close it here, <sighs> some good raid mode, real quick. No, no, no. If we're going to close it right here, then we might as well just, you know. Who, some goofy taunts. I'm picking Alex. <clears throat> Can you skip this far or no? No. Nah, it doesn't take that long. But, loading. My door. You ever tell me what's behind that door? I don't know. Please! Uh, I close open the door. Mm. My eyes were closed. Let's see. Actually, you know what? I'm picking the old man to do the to, to do the gestures. That was your fault. <laughs> Wait, what? Hold on. Let's put the volume up. That was your fault. No, no, where's the giddy, the giddy schoolgirl? <laughs> Alright, Jonathan. We'll see you later, bro. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> so, that's how he super jumped up there. To save Moira? Yeah. Street Fighter reference right there. The Goldman Day. Wait, 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 I know what I want. Where is it? Okay. Oh my god. Alright, ready? This is the best one. Okay, best, ready? best talk. Wait, wait, wait. Remember, part one of Bayonetta, complete, global, saturation. Oh my god. Uh, Yoshi Star, what do you think of these taunts? <laughs> these, uh, gestures? I'm pretty sure this dude is in the 60s Hang or safe. 70s. Hang back. <laughs> this Good is god. Fun. Come with me. You go first. Uh, let's pick uh, Alex. Do I have to answer? Maybe. Uh, put your thoughts in three words or less. There you go. Oh wait, did you get a message? Or did I get a message? No, I'm just checking. Okay. Let's see, what else do we have up here? <coughs> yeah, here, here, and I'm pl now. I'm playing as the main villain. This is this is Alex before she. Uh, Oh, well, a clear... Oh, brother and sister? Mm-hmm. Sure. <laughs> yes? Wait, let's say... Say, uh... Sorry. You imbecile! It's not my fault. It's not my fault. Pleasure is yours. Imbecile. Now say thank you. Come on, talk to me. The pleasure is yours. Praiseworthy. The pleasure is yours. Praiseworthy. Move forward. Stay there. Come with me. You imbecile. Wait here. <laughs> Praiseworthy. It's not my fault. Both of these people are complete, <laughs> utter sarcastic <laughs> ass. <laughs> something. 
Yep, perfect. Great answer, Yoshi Star. I'll accept that. It's not my fault. So, Wesker's apology is you imbecile, and Alex's is a uh, sorry. Well, Albert's. It's not imbecile. my fault. It's not my fault. You imbecile. The pleasure is yours. Crazeworthy. The pleasure is yours. These people are terrible. Wait, do we have actual voice clips for Hunk? Go. Wait. Get over here. I owe you one. That's right. <laughs> I, I, I need to play as Hunk more. Ugh. Yeah, seriously. <laughs> oh yeah, Star's costume. Uh, screw it. Let's do a rainbow mission, and then we'll we'll get to Bayonetta. I, wanna, uh, I, I think I'm I'm done. Plus, I'm, uh. all right, yeah, yeah. It's our, it's our on the fan. We're we're good then. All right, everyone. We hope you enjoyed that, uh, <laughs> including Barry's. Barry was an '80s action hero. Yeah. Just like what is this? Uh, a, per, a user named Sectus said it. Did Barry's become an '80s action hero? And I said, I, I said in his comments, Barry is my favorite '80s action hero. <laughs> yes. All right, so we're good. Yep, we're good. All right, guys. Hope you all enjoyed that. And uh, yeah. that I teleported. I'm out. Yeah, uh, we hope you all enjoyed that, and uh, we'll definitely catch you guys next time. Not next week. I'm not sure about the week after, but hopefully we'll stream again real soon. Because uh, every time we stream, something stupid happens, and it's it's always something great. Sorry, can't. Right? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Have a good night, everyone.